Um, recently, we had somebody on our show, um, Tony Wilrich. The gay crew. Did you, what you think about him? Um, he said he's the, re- he pre- said, yes, yeah. he said he's the first open. gay, open, gay, gangster rapper, crip gangster rapper. Yeah, but that is you the first openly gay rapper that's a crip. Yes, that's absolutely 100%, 1000 correct. His artist is Supreme, right? I mean, is it Supreme his manager? Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. So, are you, 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 you know, already I'm gonna ask you about Pink Pressure. Like, you sent her over and did the interview. I hadn't heard nothing else. How's she doing? Uh, I think she had got mad at me. She said, uh. She, she mad at you again? Yeah, she said, uh. Uh. It's all about time. She wants you to bring her out. Yeah, she was like, you don't take, you don't take me nowhere. You don't take everybody else nowhere. It's all about time. You don't think she ready? Uh, mentally, no. So she got to be mentally and physically. Because the devil give you tools to destroy yourself. I've heard you say that before. Yeah, he has. And you think that's pretty much that that that's that can happen? That can happen. You got to be mentally and ready for it. I seen a little boy. Put it like this. This is what I do too. Um. Uh, I sit there, and y'all know everybody who ever got mad at me, you don't hear nothing from them no more. Mm-hmm. So a lot of people get mad at you. I tell all these have been around me. What? You talking why? about what Dun, did you do Dun, to Dun, Dun, and number seven, and, all the people and, you and had? Now, and now Pink. So why? Now Pink, man. She ain't with pink. you no more, but she just mad at I you. I was never coming back manager. I was dropping singles under my company. Okay. You understand what I'm saying? So why you don't hear nothing from them no more? Because you see, you could tell it was all me. Pushing them. Damn. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. That's crazy, but I, I feel you. I feel so, you. So why, you. why you would say that? Because you should still hear them is what you say. I should still hear them. Once they leave, I just like. Or okay. even hear them even more because yeah. they should be trying to prove yeah. you so wrong. So sometimes the, the fans, I remember when number seven left and they was like, man, seven got into it. The fans like, okay, now he can finish his career now because he ain't another brain what is and that you ain't heard nothing from him. So, you know, I'll try to push the people for the best. I don't have to be around you to go to the studio. You know what I'm saying? Hey, you ever seen a nigga that play basketball, that want to play basketball? Oh, uh, Key, you had a Paquita that play basketball football? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You'll see him act like he's dribbling around the house, mm-hmm. laying up every five minutes, you know what I'm saying? You see a nigga play, act like he play football, he, he just running like he bumping mm-hmm. everything. You know what I'm saying? I don't have to tell you to go to the studio. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, no, you're right. I, I shouldn't have to tell you to go make a, I mean, to write a song. You shouldn't have to call me for, see, our managers don't pay for shit. People are confused. They believe managers pay for everything. They don't. That's an investor or a label. A manager just get you in doors that you don't belong in. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Every artist I'd have had wasn't belong. It wasn't supposed to be in that position. You know what I'm saying? No, I get it. I get it. I, I got a question. Go ahead. Go ahead. Um, recently, we had somebody on our show, um, Tony Wilrich. The gay crew. Did you? What you think about him? Um, he that's said he's the. Right? He supreme. said yes. Yeah. He said he's the first open. gay open gay. Gangster rapper, Crip gangster rapper. Yeah, but that is you the first openly gay rapper that's a Crip. Yes, that's absolutely 100%, 1000 correct. His artist is Supreme, right? I mean, is it Supreme his manager? Yeah, it's yeah, good, Bob man. Supreme. It's good. It's Bob, Bob, Bob finally came out and, and, and did what he, he, you know what I'm saying? He came out. That's good. You know what I'm saying? Okay, I mean. The nigga Tony gonna be big. So you okay. think, so that's gonna be good for, for, for Supreme? Yeah, them saying Supreme finally finally came to the the, the and the, found himself one. Find he found he found himself. Period. Mm. He found himself. Well, explain, <laughs> elaborate on that. He's like he, he like he's happy now. You, you remember when Supreme was was he first he went from from uh, K Breezy. You yeah, he's still. I K, think he's K, still K, rocking with K, K Breezy. K Breezy was was like uh, she came out said she was gay. She did? Yeah, she said she got, I didn't know you that. got to see her only fan. She got a shag, she had a shag and everything. So she found like she was gay and then here you come with Bob Supreme. 
with the first gay rapper. In fact, so, so what you okay? Keep going because you sound like you're insinuating some. Um, that that he's happy with the he, that's what he's happy now. He don't have to he don't have to go around chasing real tune no more. He don't have to go around chasing these gangsters and try to get them on film and then like that. Like he he found he, he did himself. He, 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 I'm proud of him. He finally found himself. Wow, you know, um, I tried to get y'all to set up together. I wanted to talk. Man, with they y'all. want some clout on me. But nah, that nigga Tony gonna be big. You think he gonna be big? Blanche shared him twice. Yeah, then you got Jonathan. You got you got you. He went viral on our on our. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. He go he go he go be big. I'm happy for Supreme. You think what? What do you think? You do you think he's talented? Huh? Do you think he's talented? Nah, he just got a he's a character. Okay. It's his character that they come. I ain't never listened to no damn song, uh, but it's just his character. Yeah, he took pictures with OG Percy. And yeah, he, he really, that's what I'm saying, Percy. Marketing. And what that nigga go do is, he go open the eyes up to different niggas that's there. Mm, that's undercover? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So, like, you know, you got a thousand niggas. I ain't gonna never do no song with no snitch. Yeah. And, he, and then you, you got you got niggas like Kodak over there doing songs with him, right? Yeah, yeah. And now it gonna be he gonna open the door. He go it gonna be one nigga do a song with him. They wasn't supposed to do no song with him. So he gonna get somebody on the track. Yeah, one of these the stiff dudes. Yeah, one of the stiff dudes. <laughs> one of these stiff niggas gonna be broke, and they gonna he do can't it. pay their rent and need the money. They gonna take the, they gonna take that five hundred. Wow. What, what, <laughs> what do you think? How is it okay? Should a person try to get on the radio now, or, or you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They should try to get on the radio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Is anybody like is, is I, and I don't listen to the radio a lot, but do Big X? He be is he spinning I just heard, on the radio? I him over here. So he always on there. Yeah, I just heard him over Is he the only one that you hear on there that's locally from Dallas now? Right now. Yeah, I guess. About the only one. Okay. It's this it's a new generation right now. Well, got, explain. Uh, what do you mean? The old generation with the Mo Three, Yellow Fred, Yeah Yo. Oh, that's dead. Bobby Bobby put it placed itself in that generation too now. Cause, cause he went backwards. I told him though. I ain't finna just tell him. He gonna say Ryan told me. Bobby put himself in that in that generation too, but that whole generation did. It's something about how you always you you always be you 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 try to try to focus in and make sure because you see you when you can see what's coming your way is good. This you know new what I mean? gen, this new generation right now. I'm tell you the new generation, Big X, Big X, Big X is the king of this new generation. He is the the row. He is the uh, he is the king of this new generation. Right? It's Big X, Montana Seven Hundred. Um, Zier Nerdo, Bumpy Johnson, Lizak, Savage, um, that's about it. That's about it. They the new generation of Dallas. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.